So Axiom Trade is now out. So let's go over what I think is the best filters for Pulse. But first, if you have not already signed up, then you can use my referral code 7. 7. It would help me out a lot, and there will also be a link in the description. Now let's go to Axiom Pulse. This probably reminds you of NeoVision or Meme Scope, but just an upgraded version. My favorite feature is that we can easily see what coins are bundled, which can be a big indicator if the coin will rug, and it also feels very smooth and not laggy. We can also see Insider, Snipers, Dev, and Top 10 holders. Hover over any coin to see the bonding percentage. Now let's go to Filters. Here we can choose if we want to see Radium, Pump Fun, and Moonshot tokens. The thing about Radium coins is that it can easily be a Honeypot token, Right here, for an example, a Radium coin just launched. It got $4 volume, 11 buys, no sells, and 1.8 billion market cap. I normally only leave Pump Fun on for this reason alone. Exclude keywords. Let's say bots are right now pumping out tokens called Vault, and it's everywhere. We can easily exclude them right here. And if you want to only see, for example, Vine coins, then you can type it in. Now, audits. Most of this, I don't change. Only dev holding, I normally put max 10% and bundled max 20%. And metrics, I just don't change anything. Dex paid. This is normally only something that happens when a token has already migrated. It don't really matter, especially for new pairs, so I would just leave this off. Final stretch, also known as about to migrate. This is where we can snipe coins right before they really pump. Protocols, I only leave pump fun enabled again. Bonding curve, you can change if you like. For example, minimum bonding to 95%, so it only shows coins who are really close to migrating, but I normally just let it be. Max 10% dev holding, max 20% bundled, and at least 40 holders. Metrics, I again don't change anything. Migrated, age, I like to put max 60 minutes. Dev holding max 5% now, bundled 15%, and minimum holders 75. And again, I just let metrics be. And now you can apply all, but you should always change this, depending on the market and day. Also, this is just what I prefer. A lot of people don't use any filters, so it really depends on what you like. With filters, there will still be 99% scams. So remember, nothing will keep scams out. Filters will only filter out some of them. And again, if you've not already signed up, then you can use my referral code 77. But that's about it. If this video helped you in any way, then please leave a like. It helps me out a lot more than you know. Thanks for watching.